The Amazing Turkey Rescue by Steve Metzger, illustrated by Jim Paylett. It had been a great year for Ollie, Cassie and Wink. They would escape from becoming Thanksgiving dinner on the farm and were enjoying life on the loose. During the winter, they skied on a Mount Baldy. In the spring, they played baseball with the turkey legs. When summer arrived, they hung tree in Hawaii. Now it was autumn again, just a few days before Thanksgiving. While the turkeys were busy jumping into a pile of leaves, a crow dropped a note on Cassie's hat. Read this! She squawked as she flew away. Oh no! Wink shouted. It is Sheriff! He must have heard that we escaped and now he is coming to throw us in jail. What does it say? Ollie asked. It is not from Sheriff. It is from Pete the chicken. Cassie said as she read the note. Dear Ollie, Cassie and Wink. Help! There is a fox prowling around the chicken coop. You were smart enough to escape once and now we really need you. Your pal Pete the chicken. Wait a minute. Wing yelled, what if Farmer Joe catches us? Remember last Thanksgiving? I don't want to get eaten. Wing makes a good point, Ollie said, nodding. Casey jumped up and down. Don't you understand, she said? Our friends are in danger. We've got to do something. You're right, Wing said. Let's go. They skip, they run, they gobbled. Finally, they arrive at the wooden fence surrounding the farm. Hey, there is Pete the chicken, Ollie called out. Psst, Pete. Pete raced over. You sure got here fast. Now put this on so Farmer Joe won't spot you, he said. We will meet you behind the chicken coop in a few minutes, Cassie added. When Pete left, Ollie jumped on top of Cassie, who jumped on top of Wink. After a few clumsy attempts, they put on Farmer's Joe clothing. Wink wobbled over to the farm's entrance. Howdy! A friendly voice called out. You must be one of the new workers. Ollie said nothing. My name is Hank, the farmhand said. What's yours? Again, silence. Say something, whispered Cassie. Gobble, Ollie finally said. Gabby? Hank said. For someone named Gabby, you don't talk too much. What kind of work do you do? Gobble, Ollie repeated. You cobble? Hank said, scratching his head. Oh, you are a cobbler. Well, we don't have many shoes that need fixing around here, but there must be some other kind of work you can do. I will tell Farmer Kate you are here. As soon as Hank left, the three turkeys shed Farmer Joe's clothing and raced to the back of the chicken coop. There, Waiting for them was Pete the chicken. The fox is about to pounce, Pete warned. You've got to move fast. I've got it, yelled Cassie. Here is the plan. She whispered her idea to Ollie and Wink. Okay, let's go. Just as the fox was about to enter the chicken coop, Ollie called out. Wait, don't take another step. The fox stopped and turned around. Why not? he asked. 
Look at his color, Cassie said. It's like a beautiful sunset. And those strong muscles, Wing added. He would be perfect. Perfect for what? The fox angrily asked. Who are you anyway? We are Nick, Maki and Mo, the famous Hollywood producers, Cassie replied. You might be perfect to star in our next movie, Wink added. It's called The Mighty Fox. Do you really think I could be a movie star? The fox asked. The turkeys huddled together. We are not sure, Cassie said. Let's see your teeth. The fox opened his jaws wide. They are uh, pretty sharp, she said. Now let's check out his coordination, Ollie announced. How fast can you spin? The fox twirled around and around until he began to stagger. One more thing, Wink said. Let's see how angry you can get. Casey and Ollie found a piece of rope and tied up the fox. He snarled, growled and howled. Is that angry enough? The fox asked. Yep, that's pretty angry, Cassie said. And now you are going to be very angry. Why? asked the fox. Because you are trapped, Ollie shouted. The fox screamed so loudly that everyone on the farm heard. Hey! exclaimed Farmer Kate. The turkeys who escaped last year are back. And look, said Farmer Joe, they saved the chickens from the fox. They are heroes. Hooray for turkeys! Farmer Kate and Farmer Joe cried. You are welcome to live on the farm as long as you would like. As a special reward, the three turkeys were invited to join Farmer Joe and Farmer Kate's Thanksgiving feast, where they all ate pizza. 